All right, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan Battle video. So today we are going to be showcasing the two newly extremely awakened base Vegitos on the global side of the game. Now, before we get into the gameplay, I want to quickly go over their details. So if you guys happen to already know what they do, then feel free to skip ahead about a minute or so. Okay, so starting with the Int Vegito first. His leader skill is all types keep plus 3, HP attack and defense plus 80%. Super attack causes supreme damage and raises allies attack and defense by 30% for one turn. And passive is attack and defense plus 150% plus an additional attack plus 20% per key sphere obtained. Chance of performing a critical hit plus 5% with each attack performed up to 30%. And then all allies keep plus 3, launches an additional attack. It has a high chance of becoming a super attack. Moving on to the Tech Vegito, leader skill, all types keep plus 3, HP attack and defense plus 80%, super attack, supreme damage, and raises allies attack and defense by 30% for one turn. And passive is attack and defense plus 150% plus an additional defense plus 15% per key sphere obtained, chance of evading enemies attacks including super attacks plus 5%, with each attack received up to 30%, all allies attack and defense plus 30% launches an additional attack. It has a high chance of becoming a super attack. So as you might have noticed, the Tech Vegito is much more focused on defense and support as opposed to the Int Vegito, which is uh, geared more towards offense, right? But they're both very good in their own ways, as you will see throughout the showcase. So those are the easy eight base Vegitos. This is the team, and uh, the event is the 25th World Tournament stage of Infinite Dragon Ball history. So, on this first rotation, we have the Int Vegito linked up with the LR Goku and Vegeta, and uh, he's starting with 167,000 defense with the support from the Kid Buu, which is pretty good. It's quite good, actually higher as you can see than the LR. Goku and Vegeta. So we're starting him off with a solid seven orbs right there. So we should be getting a pretty nice super. And uh, for the other Vegitos, I'm probably just gonna give them like one orb if I can, cause I don't want them to take the spotlight away from the easy eight Vegitos, you know? So Int Vegito here getting just under 3.5 mil attack for his first super. Additional super, 3.6. We could get a third. So close, so close. Okay, two very, very good supers, guys. 3.4 and then 3.6, so if you add those up, that's basically seven million attack for that first attack, or that first turn, rather. Now we have the Tech Vegito, and I think we should put him in the middle. For the most links, there we go. And he's starting with 161,000 defense, which is close to what the Int Vegito had. But the Int Vegito had 50% support from the Kid Buu. So he's definitely the better defensive option, like I said. And uh, let's just give... Let me see here. Uh, I'm going to give three orbs, I guess, to the AGL Vegito so we can get four for the Tech Vegito. Which is one less, right? No. We got seven last turn, actually. So it's three less than the Int Vegito. And I'll give one orb to the LR. Okay, so let's see what the Tech Vegito can do here. We will be getting a bit of a boost from the AGL Vegito Super here. I think it's 30% attack, if I remember correctly. Okay, so this guy's going to double Super. Almost never happens when I want him to... Yo, <laughs> are you kidding me? Well, that was unfortunate. <laughs> it happens, it happens, but um, never when I want him to, right? Like in an actual run where I want him to do as much damage as possible, he only supers once. But in a showcase, when I don't want him to hit really hard, he goes and does that. So what can you do? Um... We're back to the Int Vegito. Hopefully, we'll get to see what the Tech Vegito can do soon. But uh, linked up with the Super Saiyan Blue Vegito here, 
Let's give... Let me see... I guess just three orbs to int Vegito this time. Or maybe if I put Vegito Blue there, we can give three orbs to him. And that's four orbs. Okay, one more for the int Vegito. And we'll just give one orb to the LR. Now hopefully Vegito Blue doesn't also decide to go off. This is gonna hurt. Oh my god, yeah. <laughs> That was rough. That was rough. So that's the risk of putting Vegito Blue in the first slot for any event. Um, if he takes a super before he gets a chance to attack, then he's going to get wrecked, like we just saw there. Um, he is going off a little bit, though, which is a little bit concerning. But at least he did leave the same man alive, which I appreciate. That's one attack for the Int Vegito and two additional normals, so not as much damage as I would have liked to see, but um, still decent. With four orbs, he's getting 2.79 mil, so close to three mil. And you know, usually you can expect around four orbs, maybe a little bit more. If you bring an orb changer, of course, you can get a lot more, right? Okay, so back to Tech Vegito, and this time, I'm gonna make sure I put him in the first slot, so he can guarantee or we can get that guaranteed attack, right? So here we go, seven orbs for the Tech Vegito. 231,000 defense with good boost supporting. And let's see what this guy can do. Now, it would have made more sense to put the AGL Vegito in that first slot for the additional attack boost, but I don't really trust him anymore to not go off. Now, Tech Vegito getting 2.5, 2.6, one more. Almost killed Killa himself. Almost soloed Killa. Not quite. But for a defensively focused unit, he really does do some decent damage, I would say. Alright, um... Let me see here. Uh, I think I'm gonna leave the STR Vegito untransformed, because... He's going to share four links with the Int Vegito either way, so it doesn't make a huge difference. And I'm going to give nine orbs to the Int Vegito. Uh, I guess we'll give one orb to Vegito Blue and one orb to the LR. I have a good feeling, though, that uh, we will be able to solo the Jewel with the Int Vegito. Okay, so four point, or sorry, 3.4 mil. And I just need one, I was going to say one additional super, but nah, the normal apparently was enough. So, that was a good turn. That was a very good turn. Tech Vegito, uh, let's see. Hmm, we can give him five orbs, or we could do, we can do this, and potentially give him, probably still five orbs actually. So let's give these to the... Super Vegito, five orbs to Tech Vegito, and that's 204,000 defense, and then we'll give, uh, we'll still give a super to the LR, but no more than that. Okay. Some counters here, and I wouldn't actually mind an additional super here from the uh, Super Vegito, because that's going to allow us to get twice the attack buff from his super, and make the Tech Vegito hit a bit harder. There's a one super there, and let's see what the Tech Vegito can do now. 2.6, 2.6, okay, so it looks like we're gonna have some trouble reaching three mil with this guy. We probably can if we get the Kid Boo in here, but without support, yeah, you're generally not gonna see him do, you know, anything beyond like 2.6, 2.7. Obviously, if he had max links, which is not something that uh, I was able to get before the showcase, but they do have decent links, right? It's not like they have level one links. It's all like five and above, but uh, they definitely could be a bit better than what you see in the video if they had higher level links. And also, maybe if you want more damage, you can give them attack skill orbs. I decided to go defense because I just feel like it's more important for me personally. So, um, I guess we'll just go four orbs for Int Vegito, because 
I don't trust Vegito Blue to not super four times and kill Mighty Mask by himself in the first slot. And uh, why don't we just give one orb to Kid Buu here. So four orbs with Kid Buu, we should be seeing 2. Point, yep, 2.8. And a crit maybe. Additional super maybe. Give me, give me something. Come on. <sighs> All right, so that was not the greatest turn. <laughs> The last turn was good. This turn, not so much. Not so much. All right, now we're on my girl, Android 18. Um, let's see what we should do here. That's eight orbs for Tech Vegito. Uh, or we can do that and I'll give... Hmm. See, I don't want to give all these orbs to the uh, Super Vegito, so I guess I'll have to give him no Super for now. And we can get, once again, eight orbs for Tech Vegito. And... I'll just give one orb to the LR. Oh no. Oh, this is gonna suck. Okay, it didn't suck as much as I thought it was going to suck. But we still took some some damage right there. Okay, so Tech Vegito, 2.4, 2.4, additional super, 2.6. I feel a third super coming right now. Damn it! <laughs> I thought I could speak it into existence, you know? I thought I could speak it into existence, but uh, it's fine. It's fine. Uh, for Int Vegito, we can give him 8 orbs right now, which is great, and he should be able to finish off Android 18 here. If not, though, then the Vegito Blue will definitely be able to finish the job. Okay, 3.2, crit, there it is, additional super, 3.4, and she's done. There you go. Final boss, it's Hercule time. Uh, we should actually get a token attack here, which I will definitely give to the Tech Vegito, of course. So that's going to be six orbs for Tech Vegito. Um, let me see. Let's give these to AGL Vegito, and then we'll give some his orbs to Kid Buu for some reason. Okay, token attack, 2.5 mil attack stat. One, two, three, four, five, six. I just realized actually Kid Boo is sealed, so it really doesn't make any difference <laughs> if he gets that full 24 key, or rather, or uh, 12 key, rather. But uh, focusing on the Tech Vegito, token attack. Let me some damage, come on. Yo, that was some damage. That, that was some damage. <sighs> Man, we're not gonna get triple supers, are we? That was like our best chance, right there. Nonetheless, um, that was great. Six mil for <laughs> the Dokkan attack, and Hercule is dead. So there you have it guys, a pretty efficient run overall. Um, we did have a couple turns where it was not ideal, like in the beginning where we had uh, Tech Vegito in the second slot and then we didn't get to attack because the uh, Super Vegito just went off, right? But otherwise, good showcase, I would say. Um, my overall assessment of these Vegitos is that they're good. They're good because they provide that support on their super attacks as well as on their passives. And they're both good defensively, especially the Tech Vegito. And then the Ince Vegito can provide some more damage than the Tech Vegito. But they both hit quite hard. They both get good defense. Um, between the two, I think I actually personally prefer the Tech Vegito because I do value defense over offense. And his, his offense is not really that lacking. So, yeah, I would say Tech Vegito probably a little bit better than Int Vegito in my mind, based on my preferences. They're both very good. Um, feel free to let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about these guys. Which one do you think is better? Why does Int Vegito have six links? Somebody explain this to me, because it doesn't make any sense. <laughs> it doesn't make any sense. Uh, maybe it was like something that was decided before I started the game or something like that. But either way, I just, it never made any sense to me. 
Somebody explain it in the comments. But otherwise, um, two very good easy A's in my books. And that's going to do it for today's showcase, guys. Thank you so much for watching. As always, if you liked the video, then make sure to like the damn video. Sub to the channel if you're new. Hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And uh, until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.